Well, hello guys on YouTube today. I want to talk to you guys about E3 spark plugs. And the E3 spark plugs replaces the standard J spark plug on your two cycled and four cycled equipment. And the reason why I want to talk to you guys about the E3 spark plugs is this is the E3 spark plug, guys. It's a very new plug inside its package. It also has it saves on gas, power, performance, and everything else. It's pretty cool. It's pretty little nifty little spark plug. And also, here's the back of the um, package. Uh, it, it has a up to 12% power, up to 12%, up to 13% on gas, and it has. 50% uh, starting time, 58% uh, uh, of starting time, but here's what <coughs> the package says if you want to take a look at it. But yeah, it's a pretty cool looking E3 spark plug. But let's go ahead and pop out the J spark plug out of this old home like weed eater here. And to do that, you need a spark plug uh, removing tool. All I'm going to do is pop the boot off, take out the old plug, and stuff like that. Now, the reason why you need to do this is to try to figure out what spark plug you need to replace your, um, your J spark plug and your weed eater kill. Now, of course, <coughs> this is a J spark plug. This is RCJ6Y. But when you look on your new spark plug, you know, match it up to Kiel. Right there where my thumb's at. It is C. Oh no, it's RCJ6Y spark plug. That replaces this standard spark plug in my home like machine hill. The reason why you need that model number is when you want to buy the E3 spark plugs. Now of course the E3 spark plugs are a bit better design. See, there's what it looks like. Very new in the box. No taken out. Very new. Other thing on this E3 spark plugs new. This is what the old uh, champion spark plug. I think that's what that word says. Champion on there guys. I'm not 100% sure. But see there's the J spark plug on your that's your standard old J spark plug. And the reason why I like the uh, E3 spark plugs is they're a little bit different. The start metal you don't have <coughs> A lot of uh, performance issues with these um, spark plugs here. Um, this is just the old J spark plug that's in this one. But you can see these, this replaces a standard, um, just a standard J spark plug. I mean, it's a, it's pretty cool. I mean, <coughs> you need to know what size your spark plug is. Well, you can turn on and replace the spark plug inside your four cycled or your two cycled engine. Of course, like a weed rack or lawnmower, or, um, whatever you want. And this is called E3 spark plug. It also is E3.12. That's what the number was on the spark plug hill. That replaces the standard J spark plug. Um, so here's what the package says. Uh, it says just all and stuff on it. It's a pretty good looking spark plug. Yes, this is very new. And the sealed um, package. Not going to open it right now. I open it when I am finished building my... We rock over here. And yes, I'm also uh, rebuilding this, uh, guys, and doing up some of the stuff on it. 
But let's get into the J spell plug. The reason why it's called a J is because it has like a J loop on it. Kind of like a J uh, ground to it. But again, there's the side, there's the outside, there's the outside. <coughs> but the number you really are after is not the name of the plug. The number or the model, what you're looking for, is RCJ6Y. Again, that's going to be replace. That's going to replace this spark plug. Again, on the package, RCJ6Y spark plug, and you also have all different makes and models of spark plugs to replace. But the E3s. Or a bit better design than the J spark plugs. Now again, I don't know if you need to gap these or not, but you can get a gap tool if you want to gap these. Uh, go for it. I mean, why not? I mean, you can gap any spark plug you want. The reason why I want to talk about the E3 uh, spark plugs today for you guys is the E3 spark plugs are a bit better. On power performance, uh, one, the good for your <coughs> engine and stuff like that, versus the J spark plugs are kind of okay. But the reason the reason why the spark plugs are a bit better is, I mean, the I mean, the a little bit better performance, better trigger, or you know, better engine performance on your machine. And your engine will be a little bit more happier with one of these spark plugs versus the J uh, spark plugs. Now again, this is kind of like my overview of the uh, E3 spark plug because I bought one of these uh, for one of my older home likes. Again, this has power performance. Get, it, it says on fuel uh, performance or gas in your tank or whatever. I don't know. It also it, it's just a very good product to use for all your type of eels. Now the type of spark plug you should be looking for E3.12. That's the correct size for the uh, engine hill. For any uh, JY spark plug. Now again, it does have a website. If you don't know what spark plug you're looking for, go to e go to e three s p a r k p l u g s dot com. That's the website you can check what type of spark plug your machine needs to uh, use. Now, again, this is a uh, uh, E3 spark plug. Again, I use these. Uh, I use these all the time, and also in my old old machines, and also in my newer machines, because they're kind of a better replacement for your standard J spark plug like this one. <coughs> now, again. Your machine has to have the same type of threading as your uh, original your original spark plug hill has. When you're looking or if you're going to any type of hardware store to look for a spark plug, do take your original spark plug with you and just look at this number on the back on here. Uh, R C J six Y, and when you find it on the package, be right here. It'll be R C J six Y. That's the correct spark plug you will be re replacing your standard spark plug. <coughs> and the reason why I'll be replacing your standard spark plug is because maybe you want more power or more performance in your machine. Now, these spark plugs do last for a couple, couple, you know, up to a, a, a thousand years, I think. 
But, again, you might want to change them, or you might want to clean them once a month when uh, the season comes again. To have easy starting, uh, stuff like that, again, it's a very good overview of the E3 spark plug. And like I said, this is the packaging. This is the back. And you only get one spark plug. I would recommend picking... I would recommend pick up about maybe six or... You know, six of these uh, spark plugs for your uh, machine help. Now, of course, this is my older home-like uh, machine. Again, this spark plug is going to go in this one after I'm um, rebuild it. After I'm rebuilding it, I'm going to reuse it. It's a great machine. <coughs> With a also a new plug. Again, I had an E3 in this before. Liked it a lot. Easy start. No problems with starting. It filed when it I didn't misfile. It filed correctly when it's supposed to file. I mean, the E3 spark plugs are a lot better than your traditional uh, J spark plug like this one. If you have any J spark plugs, Eh, let's get rid of them and put an E3 spark plug in them because you would have you would have a lot of performance uh, with these spark plugs. A little bit better, a lot better. Uh, your engine will start better. Your you know you would have good engine response and stuff like that. But hey, um, it is up to you if you want to use your standard spark plug or you want to replace it with. A E3 spark plug, but I am replacing um, my E3 spark plug in this uh, with the J spark plug with this one when I get this one rebuilt. But all it is is the same threading. All you have to do is make sure you have the same threads up in your tiny uh, spark plug hole <coughs> to make sure they're the same size threads as your standard plug. Now, of course, if you don't want to spend the extra um, five bucks on one of these E3 spark plugs, but I can show you on a my on 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 my iPod in one second here, guys. I just got to open the application. Again, you can get the E3 spark plugs at Lowe's, Walmart. Uh, Home Depot, any place that sells uh, yard equipment, you can buy these spark plugs. Let's see. Uh, e? Three? All you need to type is E3. And, ta -da! There is the spark plugs. Again, it depends on the type of spark plug you're using for your machines. Again, don't get the wrong spark plug. Pick out the right one for your um, machine. I mean, each spark plug is a lot different, but that's okay. That's normal. And the reason why I say that's normal because each spark plug is not the same. Each spark plug with the E3 spark plugs are all different. Uh, you, like I said, you would like the <coughs> you like the spark plugs. You see. There's a spark plug I just picked up. See, so can you see it? E3. And it is also uh, the type of correct socket the spark plug uses. Is a one, a three and a fourth style uh, spark plug removal socket. You can also get that. You can also use this. Uh, this is called like kind of like a cheetah ball, breaker ball, kind of for your spark plugs. But you can get all on spark plugs, uh, removal lunches. And yes, and these spark plugs all about like $5.98. But that's okay. I like the, using these E3 spark plugs. But I will show you um, in a known blog, after I get this guy all built, I'll be taking out the old spark plug, putting the new spark plug in. Now, you can save the old spark plug. All you have to do is like clean it or soak it in some 
um, degree so just be careful again you just don't want to destroy your spark plugs it's a way to clean up the uh, carbon and oil uh, composites on here um, of course my phone's ringing sorry about that guys I uh, got to disconnect my phone here okay sorry about my phone was ringing <coughs> um, and my call back, whoever it was. Don't worry about it. But the E3 spark plug replaces your standard uh, J spark plug. And the reason why it replaces your, uh, reason why it replaces your J spark plug is you're not going to have any issues with the spark plug you're replacing. Now, of course, you got to make sure you take your original spark plug, find the match on the package. Again, E3 is the way to go with most of your machines. Alright guys, um, I hope you uh, like this video. Subscribe to my channel. Leave a comment below. Share this video with all your uh, YouTubers out there. Alright guys, I will do more about the overview of the E3 spark plug after I get it in my machine. Okay, peace out. Bye guys.